Okay, boys and girls, I thought that this would be a great book to read this week. It's called A Sunflower's Life Cycle, and I love these science books. I have a whole bunch of them. So, let's learn about the sunflower. Okay, here's that table of contents we were always talking about. These are all the different things that you're going to learn about in the book. Okay. A flower seed. Pop! Under the warm spring soil, a seed breaks open. It will grow to be a tall plant with yellow flowers. It is a sunflower seed. There it is. There's the sunflower seed. Look how cool that is. The seed sends out roots. Roots push up, push deep soil into the soil. They take in water and minerals. A green shoot pokes out of the dirt. There's the roots and then it pushes up through the dirt. And there's your sprout. Sprouting leaves. The shoot becomes a plant stem. The first leaves sprout from the stem. Leaves use water, sunlight, and air to make food for the plant. There's your sprout. It's getting bigger and growing leaves. <clears throat> Tiny hairs cover the stem. The hairs stop insects from climbing up the stem and eating the leaves. More leaves grow on the stem. So more and more leaves grow on the stem. Growing tall. The stem grows taller and taller. Some may grow over 12 feet, three meters high. Wow! Green leaves called bracts form on the flower bud. Very cool. Look at the pattern. We talk about patterns a lot, don't we? As the bracts unfold, yellow flower petals poke out. The petals open and the flower head grows bigger. Now it's getting bigger. Sunflowers are big flowers, aren't they? Blooming flowers. Sunflower heads have hundreds of tiny florets. Florets are co covered with pollen dust. Bees land on the bright florets. That would be a great flower for a bee to find, wouldn't it? Bees land on many sunflowers, spreading pollen among the florets. Florets have tiny ovules. Pollen and ovules form new seeds. There's the bee getting the pollen. In the fall, some sunflower seeds are harvested. Other seeds fall to the ground and they will grow into new plants in spring. So here's the old sunflower dried up from the season and the sunflower seeds fall to the ground and some of them get caught by this big machine, this big farming machine. That was pretty cool. And the cycle starts all over again from there. That was a great book. I love that. Hope you enjoyed.